This one I'm calling Crazy Cat Lady Times Infinity. Elvis, Elvis Duran, the Elvis Duran phone tap. Here we go. Scary, what's your phone tap all about? Dave wants to phone tap his wife, Judy. They're moving into a co-op in a couple of weeks, and Dave was on his way to pick up some of the papers, uh, you know, and sign some stuff from the co-op. And as you know, when you move into a co-op, you have to be voted into the building by the people on the board. Oh, that's right. Yeah, so, yeah. So co-ops can leave anyone out. That's why I never try to buy a co-op. They would never want me living with them. <laughs> that's anyway, so, okay, so the co-op, they're moving in. Right, so Dave and Judy, um, they've got a ton of exotic pets and although they really did get permission from the co-op board I'm going to pretend like there's some last minute issues with that oh here we go you know what they're ready to move in and you're going to screw it all up today's phone tap scary the co-op guy here we hello? go hello hey I'm with Victor at the co-op board alright we, we what got, about it we got a problem we got what a problem. they're not going to allow the animals when we looked at this place they said animals allowed we saw a cat walking what? around outside what I, the hell I know, are you talking I know. about they know about the animals you knew about about the animals. You didn't take me to places unless they allowed animals. So get that yeah. out of my face because I got to do more ad work. Hey, hey. Says, no, 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 no. We take exotic. No, no, what they're doing, they want more money. Exotic. They want more money and tell them to go f themselves because we it's went not, through this it's again. It's not about the money, babe. It's what? about the neighbors. The neighbors can't take it. That's we didn't even meet the neighbors yet. Pain in the I'm going to come down there. I'm going to. How about no, you tell them no. to call me? Okay, I'll go inside. I'll, I'll get the guy on the phone. You can talk to him directly, okay? I'll talk to him. It is a mistake. I know it. There's a whole board has to approve, and my vote is no. Can you, like, talk to my wife? Hello? I mean, Hello? Who am I talking to? Hey! Who's this? It's Judy. I'm the one supposed to be moving into your place in two weeks. Now my husband comes out and says that there's no animals allowed, and I... I this yeah. is the whole reason I picked your place. We approved a dog and a cat. Well, I got a dog and a cat. You've got no. a python, a gecko, a ferret, a chinchilla, and a parrot. Oh what are you running, a pet store over there? No, I love animals. I rescue animals. They're as quiet as can be. They don't bother anybody. And, oh, Zeus, Zeus. What yeah. was that? Was that even a dog? <laughs> yeah, well, you know, I'm getting uh, I'm getting something delivered. Zeus, come here. Come back in. Come back in. Okay. Now, that's, that's abnormal. That's because somebody left the package. Oh. Can you imagine this going on with all the thin walls and the neighbors around you all day long? My office is going to be dealing with this. I'm not signing this. Uh, You're not coming in. Oh, come on. If they met Zeus, they'd feel differently. What is Zeus? Well, he's a brown and white pit bull. And a he's pit very bull? Friendly. Yes, but you know... Pitbulls so, bite off limbs. No, no, no. They get a bum rap. Do you charge admission to your house? <laughs> I, you know, put my husband back You're on. not coming here. It's Animal Planet. My animals are good. They're well behaved. If your dog can talk right now, life. it's saying, get me out of this place. Oh, no. Oh, get no, me out of this crazy, insane life. asylum. My animals have a good life. You don't say anything like that to me. They're everything to me. And they're a lot better than people, let me tell you that. What chinchilla do you have? Oh, his name is Chili. He lives in the bathtub because he has to roll around in sand, but he's completely silent. Hold on. Your husband said that you have a python named Helen. All right. Helen was going to be thrown down the sewer by these boys, and she stays in her tank. I never let her get and out. And snakes eat mice, so you're feeding well, it mice. No, I have a pet mouse named Henry. Henry you have a mouse as a pet? Yes, yes. Henry had so much... I have to... Yes, they do eat mice. I'm not going to lie about that. But Henry had so much personality, I took him back out of the tank, and he has his own tank the now. The only thing fun. that we accounted for was the orange cat named Crunchy. And yes. you had one dog, but you have a second one, I'm learning. Well, that's Brick. We had to get Brick to keep Zeus company, because he's high energy. And But they just play together. Brick doesn't bark. He just wags his tail. He never makes a sound. Well, I'm sorry. You, can, you guys, this is not the place for you. Wait a minute. Wait, I'm all packed up. I mean, look for a year to find a place like that because this is discrimination you discrimination for what but the fact that I'm not allowing the zoological society to move into one of my units uh, that house must stink what? your ass must stink you know something you got a nerve to do this I don't know who the you are but we have been coming I'm the last signature on that co-op board sheet oh, really? and I'm not signing it excuse me you didn't tell me that you had a ferret named Sanchez that runs loose around the house. Sanchez is a beautiful, quiet ferret. He goes in a litter box. He sits with the cat. Sanchez goes on the table and eats off his plate because it's affectionate. Do you even associate with humans or is this your whole life? Guess what? If I only get along with my animals, I'll sit in the house and I won't talk to the other 
walking past me on the street. You're in a power trip. You got to sit on these boards and you think of people like us that are working people and you want to lord it over us because you're big rich who own these companies and everything. You're really gaining points now. Yeah, you start it. You start it. I'll finish it, honey. I'll finish it. I'm from Jersey. You want to start a fight with me? I'll finish it. Come on. You want to meet in person? Come yeah. on. Yeah, okay, Come on meet over. me. I'll leave the dogs in the house. Meet Come me. over. I'll Come give over. you another pet. What? I'm going to give you a cockatoo. I have a cockatoo. Yeah, I know. His name is Bobby. Your husband told me. Oh, oh he really spilled his guts, didn't he? Well, my husband on the phone. Yeah. First of all, I want you to walk away from that man because I'm going to put my fist through this phone line and pull out his tonsils if I hear one more thing. You've been phone tapped. What the f***? What are you talking about? Judy, this is Gary Jones from Elvis Duran in the Morning Show. What? Oh, Dave! Very funny. Ha, 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 ha. You got me all upset. You got Zeus upset. You know, I got the animals kitty litter packed already and everything, and I thought I didn't have a house. That was scary. Elvis Duran phone tap. She's my favorite person ever. Oh, my God. That was awesome. Oh, my God. I love that she rescued the mouse from the python because he had personality. Oh. <laughs> I love I want to party with her. And please acknowledge, Scary, yes. that you know that pit bulls are great dogs. They are great dogs. All right. I was just trying to get at her. Yeah, okay. All right. Just That's making sure. That's the best sure. phone tap ever. I mean, she is fantastic. <laughs> the zoological society. She really has a lot of, <laughs> a lot of uh, animals and a lot of other things, too. Yeah. Good job. Excellent. All right. That's your phone tap. This phone tap was pre-recorded with permission granted by all participants. The Elvis Duran phone tap only on Elvis Duran in the Morning Show. Oh, that was that was great. <laughs>